the champion of smartphone cameras versus the new contender for the crown. The Pixel 2 and the Galaxy S9 Plus are undoubtedly the best camera phones out there right now. Sorry iPhone 10 fans, but that's the truth. I mean, if we go by the DxO Mark score, the S9 Plus is the new champion. But is that true? Does the new Samsung flagship indeed manage to beat everyone's favorite camera phone, the Pixel 2? Well, let's find out. What's up guys, this is Rupesh from bwam.com and today we are putting together the battle of the best camera phones, the Pixel 2 and the Galaxy S9 Plus. Yeah, this should be a lot of fun, but before we get started, I think you should hit the bell icon to make sure you don't miss out on any of our future awesome videos. Also, this video has been brought to you by MailTag, an email tracking Chrome extension which has just been updated with some great new features. Now then, let's get on with the comparison. First, let's get the camera specs out of the way. On one hand, we have the Galaxy S9 Plus with its 12 megapixel camera that offers dual apertures of f1.5 and f2.4, along with a secondary 12 megapixel f2.4 telephoto lens for portrait mode shots. On the other hand, we have the Pixel 2 with its 12 megapixel f1.8 camera and Google's software prowess for portrait mode photos. Now then, let's get on with the battle, shall we? First, let's take a look at some daytime photos. Let's start off with the graffiti here. Now it's obvious here that both the S9 and the Pixel 2 have captured a very similar photo. Both the photos have good colors and almost identical details but zoom in on the back and you can see that the S9 Plus photo is overexposed. While the Pixel 2 maintains perfect colors and detail. Points to the Pixel 2 here. The next photo is one of my favorite photos and this time the S9 camera shows its prowess. I mean look at that beautiful shot from the S9 and that's mainly due to S9's camera maintaining the yellow tint from the sun. Plus it handles sun flare perfectly. The Pixel 2 photo is good too but the Pixel 2 hasn't judged the sun flare too well. So points to the S9 plus here. Here's another pair of photos. I like the Pixel 2 photo here. I mean the details are pretty similar in both but the S9 photo just seems too warm for my liking. The Pixel 2 manages to capture the colors perfectly. Another Pixel 2 photo I like more is this one. Here the Pixel 2 just shows that the camera captures more detail than any other phone out there. The S9 photo is great but just zoom in you can see that the Pixel 2 camera captures more crisp detail of the Lotus Temple. See it's pretty apparent here that I prefer the Pixel 2 when it comes to daytime photos and that's because the Pixel 2 camera captures shots with more detail, sharpness and better colors. The S9 Plus is pretty great too, I mean it handles harsh lighting like a pro, like in this shot, or even in this shot. But overall the Pixel 2 wins it for me when it comes to daytime photos. Now let's move on to low light shots which is where the S9 is set to excel at with its wider f1.5 aperture. Well take a look at this, it's true the S9's wider aperture does capture more light. The S9 photo is brighter and the colors look very pleasing, the Pixel 2 photo is great too but just zoom in and you'll see a bit of noise. And it's not just this photo, there's another one, the Pixel 2 image does look very sharp and overall nice but just zoom in and you'll again find noise. The S9 again captures more light without as much noise as the Pixel 2. Moving on to the next photo, the Pixel 2 photo here looks better. The flower is sharp and sure there's noise when you zoom in but it looks good. The S9 photo on the other hand completely blurs out the flower behind it. So there's that. In the next photo, the Pixel 2 again surprises us. I mean, look at the amount of light in the Pixel 2 photo here. Again, there's noise but you cannot even see the car properly in the S9 Plus photo. Which is surprising. I think it's Google's software prowess at work here. So which phone is the winner when it comes to low light shots? Well, I'll go ahead and say the S9 Plus. I mean, it's pretty close because the Pixel 2 is just a champ in some photos. But the S9 photos don't have as much noise as the photos in the Pixel 2 and that's a big deal for me. I mean nobody wants noise in the photos. Now we have everyone's favorite, the portrait mode shots. Let's start with this photo and I'm pretty sure you know which photo is better. The Pixel 2 is just bang on with the details and the colors. Even the bokeh looks way better on the Pixel 2. The S9 photo is fine with good edge detection but the colors just seem washed out. In the next photo, the S9 ups the ante and produces a shot that is almost as good as the one from the Pixel 2. But I still prefer the Pixel 2 photo, which is sharper and has better colors. 
Let's move on to low light portrait shot and well the pixel 2 shot of yours truly is just way better than the one taken by the S9 plus. I mean let's just zoom in on the face. Now that's a huge difference. The pixel 2 shot is just way better, it's sharp and there's good colors and details. The S9 plus photo is just meh. Yeah. The same is the case with all the other low light portrait shots, just look at this. The S9 plus just does not hold up well against the pixel 2 even though it has dual cameras. Well, the Pixel 2 has always been the champion when it comes to portrait mode shots and it reigns supreme even against the new S9 Plus. Now let's talk about videos. Here's a video we shot side by side from the Pixel 2 and the S9 Plus. Well, as you can see, the Pixel 2 video is just way more stable even though both have OIS. S9 Plus has dual OIS by the way, but right now it seems it has no stabilization. I mean, here's another video we shot and it's the same story all over again. Look, the S9 Plus takes some great videos when it comes to colors and focusing, just like the Pixel 2, but the poor stabilization just kind of ruins the experience. Anyways, S9 Plus fans don't really be sad. The S9 Plus has super slow-mo videos, which the Pixel 2 lacks, and that is a big difference if you're into slow-mo videos. Here's a slow-mo video from the S9 Plus, which is at 960 FPS, and the Pixel 2, which shoots at 240 FPS. See the difference? The super slow-mo from the S9 Plus just makes things way more cool. It's 720p and only works in good light situations, but it's a nice feature to have. Lastly, there's the front camera. The S9 Plus has an 8 megapixel f1.7 camera, while the Pixel 2 has an 8 megapixel f2.4 camera. On paper, the S9 Plus definitely looks superior, but that's only on paper. Check out these portrait selfies we took. Well, it's pretty clear who's the winner. I mean, take a look at the selfie here. The details and the sharpness on the Pixel 2 photo is just amazing. Not so much on the S9 Plus photo. I have no idea why Samsung just smoothens the selfies. Even the edge detection is not good enough. The same is the case with other selfies too, be it in daytime or even low light. Look, the selfies from the S9 Plus are fine. And they should be good enough for most people. But they aren't as good as the ones from the Pixel 2. So, which is the best smartphone camera, the Pixel 2 or the S9 Plus? Well, I think you already know the answer. I mean, the S9's dual aperture makes sure it captures some great daytime photos and some amazing low-light photos. Seriously, low-light photography on the S9 is just wow. There's also super slow-mo video which is pretty great in well-lit situations. But honestly, the Pixel 2 is still the best camera phone out there. I'll accept that its low-light capabilities aren't as great as the S9 Plus. But apart from that, the Pixel 2 wins in almost every other scenario. Better daytime photos, better portrait mode photos, better video recording, better selfies. Look, if you get the S9 Plus for the camera, you won't be disappointed, honestly. It's very, very good. But if you put it against the Pixel 2, well, the Pixel 2 with all of Google's software prowess is definitely more superior. Talking about superior things, MailTag is a free Chrome browser extension for your Gmail account that lets you track your emails with ease schedule your emails for any date and even automate your email follow-ups. Yes, all of that in a very easy to use interface. And the best part, it's 100% free. So be sure to check out MailTag from the link in the video description below. Well, that was our camera comparison of the Pixel 2 versus the Galaxy S9 Plus. What do you think? Tell us in the comment section down below. Also, give this video a thumbs up and share it with the friends who are looking to buy the Pixel 2 or the S9 Plus. Lastly, subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. Well, that's me signing off. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.